Hi, how are you today? So, we're almost to Halloween, certainly a, a day of the year that many people enjoy, a really fun day of the year for children and for the young at heart. Now, in this brief little video, I'm going to be talking about something very interesting, something that I've always found fascinating. I'm going to be talking about this. This is a Halloween sound effects CD. Well, of course, back in the day, you used to be able to buy uh, Halloween sound effects records and then CDs and cassettes and so on. Uh, these are certainly something that you hear at a lot of Halloween parties. I remember as a kid going out trick-or-treating with my friends and every so often you'd knock on a door, the door would open and you would hear these spooky, creepy sounds in the background. This is just a really cheap one that I found at my local dollar store. I think I might have paid two dollars for it. Uh, it's called a Horror Sound CD. And uh, most of it is pretty cheesy. Most of it sounds like it was recorded in someone's very primitive home studio. But basically I wanted to take a very quick look at the history of Halloween sound effects CDs and sound effects recordings. I actually went online and tried to discover what was the very first Halloween sound effects album. And I couldn't. Uh, I looked and looked. I certainly found many examples of this genre, but I couldn't quite determine what was the very first one. If you know, maybe you're an expert on this uh, genre. Uh, I certainly am not. But if you know what the very first Halloween sound effects album was, please leave a comment. But basically, doing some research, I discovered that Back in the day, uh, mostly back in the 60s and the 70s, there was a label called Pickwick. And I remember Pickwick when I was a kid. They used to make a lot of children's uh, albums. And Pickwick released a couple of classics. One of them was called Sleepy Hollow. And it was actually the story of Sleepy Hollow read by Boris Karloff. And they also issued an album called Sounds of Terror, which from what I understand is quite a classic. Uh, there was also another label called Power Records and they released a series of very infamous book and 45 record sets and these often featured uh, stories on the Wolfman, Dracula, all the classic uh, horror monsters. Uh, there was also a, another label called Peter Pan and they released an album called Ghostly Sounds which from what I understand is another classic that uh, many people have said is one of their personal favorites. Finally, Disney actually released a, a, a more than one Halloween sound effects album. They released one called the Chilling Thrilling Sounds of the Haunted House, uh, which was first released in 1964. And uh, it seems that many families had that record on standby to be played on Halloween night. So that's just a very quick little brief look at some classic Halloween sound effects albums. Certainly I'm sure many of you play them in the background on Halloween night. Uh, let me know what are some of your favorites? What, are, what do you think are some classic Halloween sound effects albums? Please leave a comment. I'd love to know. Uh, I hope you all have a wonderful Halloween. I love Halloween. I'm really a kid at heart, uh, and it's still something that I enjoy quite a bit. Uh, so, if you are going out trick-or-treating, uh, if you're spending some time with your family, I hope you have a wonderful and a spooky Halloween. Thank you very much. Please leave a comment, give us a thumbs up, please subscribe, and we'll see you again next time. Take care. Bye-bye.